Hi guys, uh, this is Mr. Q. I'm here at my home. Uh, I'm about to do some yard work and also my wife wants me to uh, to plant a rosemary bush. And we have a couple planters in the front. I already did one, but here, let me show you the other one. Here they are. Well, here's the, uh, the planter. You guys see it? There it is. And here's the rosemary. Right here. And here's my tool, little shovel. All right. So basically, um, before I planted, uh, I wanted to show you how math could be found everywhere. So let me show you what I'm talking about. All right. Check this out. So if I was to, um, if I was to, let me get this out of the way. If I was to plant this, but before I do, do you guys see how this is totally flat, right? Yep. So. Um, when it's totally flat, let's say this is ground zero, flat, okay? And I wanted to, to start digging my, my hole. So if I start digging my hole, I'm going to get seven little shovels out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So if you notice, now we have a hole. The hole, from now on, we're going to call it a, since it doesn't have anything, any dirt in the hole that's a negative, the dirt outside, you see this mound right here? It's a positive. So how many shovels did I get out? Seven, so this is negative seven, that's right. And this is a positive because the dirt is outside. So how much is that? That's right, positive seven. So those we call opposite numbers. When we have opposite numbers, check this out, look what happens when we combine them. I'm going to combine the 7 negative and the 7 positives. And I end up with the same thing that I started with, a flat surface, which is known as what? That's right, ground zero. Well, guess what? The positive 7 and the negative 7 are known as opposite numbers. Opposite numbers are also called zero pairs. All right, and I just wanted to show you that so that you know how math is used on a daily basis that even though we don't know it, but uh, that's just to get us started with our lesson. All right, let me plant this and then uh, we'll get started with, uh, with the lesson. All right, see you guys tomorrow, bye.